As the pandemic continues to put a strain on hospitals, on Thursday, the Maryland Nurses Association welcomed President Biden's announcement of a vaccine mandate. We have the tools to combat COVID-19. In an interview with WSA 9 following the president's speech, the group described long lines at hospitals due to surges in COVID patients. As Virginia and Maryland both see big spikes in daily cases, Dr. Nana Phillipson said the mandate will make a big difference at a crucial time. The rate of severe illness, the demands for overtime, the long, long waits in the emergency room that we have now, those things will be mitigated. With the mandate applying to all federal workers and contractors in D.C. on Thursday, at least one federal contractor saw the importance of not only protecting himself, but others as well. It's not just my liberty not to get the shot. It's my liberty not to give this disease to somebody else. But the announcement also brought some criticism. Despite encouraging members to get vaccinated, the American Federation of Government Employees, which represents over half a million federal and D.C. government workers, wrote in a statement, quote, changes like this should be negotiated with our bargaining units where appropriate. Put simply, workers deserve a voice in their working conditions. <laughs> Moving forward, the Maryland Nurses Association hopes this latest push brings relief on the medical front lines. Children would be safer in schools and the hospitals wouldn't be flooded. Tom Dempsey, WUSA 9.